How's it going guys, Sharblox here. Welcome back to another Roblox video here on the channel. So in today's video, guys, we are going to be talking about Roblox Limited. I'm pretty sure it's been ages since the last time I made a Roblox Limited item related video. To be fair though, there hasn't really been any interesting limited item news recently. The last few waves of limited items we had were kind of boring. I guess the Vans XD North Face limited items were okay. We had the McLaren Racing stuff as well. Oh yeah, and we can't forget about those weird Gucci limiteds. If you guys wanted to see all of the collectible limiteds for yourself, you'd go over to the avatar shop, make sure you're on recently updated. And yeah, as you can see, we had the McLaren stuff, Vans X North Face ones. These ones weren't too bad. They looked pretty cool, I guess. They're not doing that well though. Then we had the new set of Gucci limiteds, which I really don't like. I think these look kind of ugly, but there you go. We had the Super Bowl stuff, more Super Bowl stuff, the Ralph Lauren polo accessories, Zara Larson's face. That's doing really well. 12k robux and it used to be 150 that's kind of insane you were lucky if you purchased this one so yeah guys those are the most recent limited items we had it's nothing really that exciting is it but we do have two topics to talk about in today's video so let's get on to the first one and this is very good news for limited item owners so here is a tweet guys from roblox trading news shout out to them i'll link their twitter down below make sure to go ahead and follow them and these guys said many smaller items which fit the rap based chart have been inflating at a quick rate images below being examples do you think the economy will deflate anytime soon why or why not so what they're basically saying here is that smaller limited items stuff that's kind of cheap basically not like millions of robux or anything are inflating at a crazy price so that means the price of these smaller limited items is going up very quickly and apparently all of a sudden guys some of these limited items that were previously pretty cheap are now very expensive especially Especially most of the stuff shown in this screenshot. All of this stuff here has gone up in price quite a lot. Roblox Trading News was saying these limiteds here are doing really well. So the Playful Vampire, the Horns, the Roblox Madness, is that what it's called? And some creepy looking mermaid face. I think it was called that. I can't remember. So I went over to the Roblox Avatar shop and went on to the collectible section. And if you guys choose like pretty much any limited item here, so like this face, for example, not so friendly. If we scroll down, guys, and take a look at the price chart, as you can see, normally this thing sells for like 40k robux 35k 35k again 35k again so basically normally this thing sells for 35k except for this guy which sold it for 20k maybe they were hacked i don't know but if we take a look at the current price it's 64,000 robux almost double the recent average price which is kind of mad if you think about it like the playful vampire as well i own this face i do quite like it it is kind of cool as we can see guys 30 days ago it was worth 50,000 robux now it's like exactly 10k more which again is kind of bonkers but it's very good for owners of this item just like myself if you were trying to purchase one of these maybe it's not so good but yeah good news for anyone which owns it i have to admit guys it probably will go down again but at the moment it's looking pretty good i just happened to come across something really interesting so have a look at this guys last year on january the 4th i uploaded this video roblox limited's price inflation what made them so expensive and in the video guys i went over to the avatar shop and as we can see all of these limited items are pretty expensive keep in mind i'm on the low to high section and the cheapest one here is what like 827 robux and that's pretty expensive for like a cheap limited but also keep in mind at this time the gucci limiteds hadn't come out yet so i think when i uploaded this video the last limited was like halloween of 2019 yeah i think so if i'm remembering correctly that was probably like the halloween dominus or something but then guys it gets even more interesting because again last year but in may so may the 27th to be exact i uploaded this video limited items are selling really cheap traders are angry and look at this so i compared this egg with stars on in 2018 it was 300 robux in 2020 it was 1200 and later in 2021 it was only 800 it's going to be a really interesting test in this video what is this egg worth in 2022 has it gone up has it gone down i guess let's go and find out i can't exactly remember the name of this thing so i I just ended up typing an egg. Hopefully I can find this. Oh, there you go. I found it. Starry egg of the wild ride. Hey, good news for everyone which owns this egg. It's gone up even more. Now it's selling for 1,360. Might be because it's kind of like Easter time, you know, April. But I don't know. I guess it's going up anyway. That's kind of cool, actually. Roblox Limiteds are definitely not dying. So at the time of recording this video in April of 2022, if I go to collectibles, all collectibles, then guys, if I go to low to high, so the 
cheapest limited we can get is 857. Oh wow, Roblox limiteds really are going up in price. I honestly didn't expect that. I thought the cheapest one would be like 600. Well, fair enough. Roblox trading news weren't wrong. All Roblox limiteds are going up in price. Maybe I should join Trade Hangout and check out my account. I have not played Trade Hangout in such a long time. My account has 2.3 million in limiteds. What? That can't be right. How the heck has it got 2.3 million? I swear the last time I checked, guys, it was like 1.5. I don't understand that. How has it gone up so much? Is it the Valkyrie Helm that's gone up? That's kind of strange. I really didn't expect that. Oh, damn. Some of the prices of these gears has gone insane. 35k for that Kawaii cat? What the heck? I'm kind of amazed, guys. I didn't expect this. Maybe I should sell some of this stuff or give it away. I don't know. I did promise you guys at one point I would give a lot of these away. And yes, I'm still doing that. I'm honestly just trying to devex my Robux, but it's more complicated than I thought, to be honest. But once I do that, I don't really care about limiteds, so I will be giving some of these away for sure. But yeah, there you go. That's honestly really sick. But to make sure to keep in mind, guys, they could potentially drop their value again. Back to last year's video very quickly. So when I uploaded this video, I think items were starting to get like really cheap. I guess we can find out. Let's have a look. So yeah, look at this. Some of the Gucci stuff was literally selling for like one Robux. Obviously, that was getting purchased like very quickly. Let's look. 400, 500. Yeah, these limiteds were pretty cheap. And finally, guys, on to the second topic for today's video, also from Roblox Trading News. So again, shout out to them. This is actually a change on the Rollymons website. So Roblox Trading News said, Rollymons has just abolished the wrap-based system, meaning every item with a value is now proof-based, including items like Legitimate Fedora and Space Hair. Many people think this is an April Fool's prank, but it is not. What do you think about this change? Okay, this one is a little bit strange. So I'm guessing, guys, now it says old and new, like value changed. So the old value for this one was 26,000. Now it's 24,000 and it has like a little down arrow. And this one, for example, the old value was 12,000. Now it's gone up to 13,000. Is that how it works? But then for some of them, it says fluctuating and stable. That's a bit odd, but I guess it kind of makes sense. Maybe they implemented this because of all of those projected items. I mean, projected stuff is kind of annoying. So I guess that would make sense, right? The RoPro Roblox extension team said it was good. They support a change, so yeah, I guess it's okay. And these guys said rap was a flawed metric anyway. But on the Rollymons website myself, guys, it still says rap. Unless I'm supposed to be on deals. I don't know, I'm super confused. Yeah, it still says rap here as well. I don't know, guys, this is kind of strange. I guess we can show projected items. Oh, wow, there's literally tons of them. That's a bit of a disaster, isn't it? The owner of the Rollymons website does explain it here. He basically just says they're phasing out the rap system, which is fair enough. If you guys want to pause the video and read all of this, go ahead and do that. I basically already explained it in my own words anyway. But yeah, he basically says that rap no longer plays a big part in the Roblox Limited's economy, and it doesn't really make sense to keep on using it. I guess it mostly is because of projected stuff, but yeah, there you go. And the final limited item for today's video, guys, this is just some very quick news. It's basically a rumor. The next Roblox Limited we might get will be a Dolo Tonight Limited. Well, I think so, guys. The Dolo Tonight concert is the next concert which is going to happen on Roblox, so we will just have to wait and see. If you guys enjoyed this video, as always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.